he's real. If you say his name, or even think it, he'll come for you. The Bye Bye Man is a terrifying story that falls along the lines of a Greek tragedy. And I would call it a Greek tragedy because the characters don't realize that they're doomed. And they fight the good fight and even do make great progress in fighting the Bye Bye Man. But in the end, he's far too powerful for them, for them to overcome. So it's a, it's a story of growth and, 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 and fear and redemption and um, anxiety and hallucination. And on the way, they find out who they are. He brings out their worst qualities. What he does is he makes you your most lowest self. Well, house off campus with John Henry and a live-in girlfriend. Should we do it? <laughs> yeah. You ready for this? What the hell is that? What is it? If you catch something like that, if you catch a disease and, and it makes you crazy, that's really scary. It's really scary to lose your mind. And that's why this is a very modern horror movie. It's not a person running around with a knife. It's not a person who's gonna jump out at you. It's not a haunted house story. It's, it's a story of losing your mind because you have a virus that gives you that. And that's, that's, that's what makes it something that's very um, unusual and, 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 and terrifying. What happened? You're gonna tell me you know that? Please don't make me say it. Don't say it, don't think it. If I tell you about him, you and your kids, you're all dead. I was um, a little nervous, I have to admit, you know, she has such a, a reputation, she's so brilliant. Um, and it was so um, incredible to work with her. She's this warm, you know, um, yogi. She's really like a yogi, you know, um, um, uh, she's not an instructor, but she has a, a kind of a, a side that, that, that's very, 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 very powerful about the world being, you know, you know living together in harmony. And, you know, and then she has this badass pers persona, which is like this. So if you get to know her, there's a whole other soft level beneath her strength. And when we worked, um, you know, you know the, the part she was playing was, was, a, was a, you know, a, a detective, you know, Detective Shaw. And she, she really, really, really brought it to an, a, a level of emotion that I wasn't expecting. Um, Carrie Ann Moss was um, really, really quite, quite brilliant and filled out moments that I, I, I would never have expected anyone to be able to do. And, and she brought um, a strength and a, and a, and a, and a genius to, to this part that is powerful in the movie, powerful. He's found us. Who? Oh. Thank you, don't say it. Bye bye, man. <laughs> Women don't get a chance to direct. They don't, they, people don't like, they, they think of a president, it's not a woman. Look what's happening to Hillary. They think of an astronaut, it's a man. They think of a president, it's a man. They think of a director, it's a man. And it's really, 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 really hard to get in the position to get hired. And he gave me that opportunity, and we, we talked about a bunch of projects. And then, bye bye, man, the rights of bye bye, man came back to him. He had them, they, they went away, they came back. And when they came back to him, he showed them to me. And um, I just thought there was an extraordinary potential for the story. And I developed the project with my, with my husband, Jonathan Penner, and with Trevor. And we really worked on it for about three years. We worked on it, we worked on it, we rewrote it, we revised it. Um, and in the end, that's how the property came together. The more you think about him, the closer he gets. He's trying to get inside of us. Jesus. He makes us see things. Directing is collaborative. I like to hear lots of ideas from people, but in the end, it's, it's up to me to choose. And I have my vision, and my vision is, is clear, and, and, and I plan, and I work very hard before I get there so that it's almost a little boring when I'm on set. I have a very detailed shot list, a very, very detailed sense of transitions between scenes. We rehearse, I know what I want from the actors. But there's always something that you miss. 
and there's always something that could maybe elevate your game, and, and that's where he, he gives me um, support. Uh, Trevor does that too. There's, there's, a, there's a sense of partnership that I'm open to that maybe not everyone else is because I know my game is going to be better, and I, and I feel that I have um, a team com camaraderie. And while my vision is the most important and that is the one that we have to follow, I can't ignore great ideas because great ideas come from many places, and I, and I love working that way. We have to help them! No, no, it's a trick! Bye-bye, man.